hello guys welcome to the channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to use meta trader 5 and you can see how it's already installed so i'm going to open it right here so now let me explain it real quick because i don't want to waste much of your time so this first section is the quote section this is the quote section and each asset is the currency peers you can actually trade and if you click on this plus icon you are going to be able to add new assets to your quotes all right new assets you want to go ahead and trade and if i go back and click on this edit i'll be able to arrange rearrange them the order i want in the order i want and once you don't click on back and it's going to be arranged right then if you click on this icon this menu icon right here you're going to get to where you'll be able to manage your account so i have my account connected my fbs demo account i'm making my demo account right here so you, you can create an account for the first time you're going to get metatrader 5 android demo which comes with that so i'm going to click on trade so once you click on the menu back again and click on trade you come back to the trade section you can see i have two trades entered so let me explain so if you come to the chart section you're going to see how the price is doing all right you're going to see uh, more information about the um, the, the currency peers and if you click on this icon you're going to get the exact points you want to trade or something you get the exact points and if you click on this if you click on this next one this next one has to do with indicators you can add indicators so i have to add, I have two indicators added the m macd and the moving average if you want to add them you click on it and you just click on them and you're going to add them so the next one uh, has to do with you changing the time frame of the particular chart so right now it sets to week which is week w has to do with week and if you click on it you can see m1 m1 is one minute m has to do with minutes h has to do with hours d has to do with day m h m n has to do with month all right so that's it and this next section this next one has to do with buy and buy um buy buy stop sell stop buy stop limit and sell stop limit which might actually be a little bit confusing for you so if you want to do this so sell stop remember sell is from sell is starting this is let's say this is the line so let's say this is let's say this is the, sorry i'm trying to get that there i say this is the line above is for buy below is for sell remember so if you want to do a sell stop a so a sell limit it means your sell limit let me say i'm placing the trade right here i'm placing the trade right here then my sell stop should be placed somewhere above above let me say my sell stop should be here and my take profit let me do it again my take profit should be around here i'll say around here then i'll click on this icon click on this icon right here and if you click on it, it's going to take you to the section so now you can go ahead and place your trade you can place your trade and you can also change the price if you want to change the price you can change the price you can change you can also change the lot you can increase it you can increase it and you can also tap if you wish to, if you don't want to do the sell limit um, you can also go ahead and do the sell stop you can do buy limit you can do sell limit and you can also do market execution market execution has to do with just by just entering the market instantly which i'm going to do right here i'm going to click on sell and it's done and when i come to trade you're going to see your assets you're going to see assets that you've um, you've purchased all right let me, let me see your trade so um if you click on history history has to do with when you end the trade so let me end this trade for example i'll hold it it's going to pop up then i'm going to click close position and cl uh, close with loss since this is a demo account i don't care then if you come to the history you can see it right here you can see the ps ended you can see i have a my profit is showing minus one and if you come to message message has to do with you get some messages from um from meta trader so now if you wish to trade if you need to change your term you can change your term by clicking on this and coming to settings and scroll down to the bottom and click on choose term then you can change the term i'm going to choose the system setting all right on the system setting this is how it's going to look like so i think i've explained every single thing you need to know about meta trader 5 and if you come to trade again let me come to charts real quick and if you click on this next icon let me explain this next icon for you guys this next icon has to do with you going this is market execution right you can enter the market through market execution you can buy and sell you can buy and sell with this all right so if you come to trade you're going to see your assets so you can see currently this one is about to do well you can see this one is about to do well so i think that's it guys on everything you need to know about meta trader 5 for android i hope you found the video really helpful and if you did kind of like don't forget to follow for more and I will see you guys in the next video.